We're live now. Okay. Hi there, guys. Uh, you're watching us here at BC Laser and Skin Care. Uh, and today we're going to talk about the color red. Uh, red is a great color, but on the face, sometimes it can be bothersome. Uh, so uh, people can have red blood vessels, uh, generalized redness, uh, rosacea, uh, and it can be quite bothersome. And somebody like uh, Alina here, who has uh, kindly volunteered, uh, has got beautiful skin, but she does have a little bit of red on the chin and around the nose and a little bit on the cheeks and she wants to get rid of it because she wants to be able to have the choice not to wear makeup. At the moment she wears makeup all the time and uh, she loves wearing it but uh, there are times when she wants to be makeup free. Uh, so we're going to do a redness treatment uh, with um, the XLB laser. <coughs> The XLB laser uh, is excellent for redness, uh, it gets rid of red vessels, it gets rid of uh, uh, generalized diffuse redness and it works uh, quite well for that. Um, what I would like to do is, can we just close that? is uh, do a treatment with the XLB today and you can see there is some redness around the nose, around the cheeks, around the chin and uh, this laser does treatments with a couple of other uh, 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 wavelengths as well uh, but we're just going to use the uh, 532 nanometer wavelength uh, but this laser has got uh, multiple other treatments it can do as well. Um, How many treatments will she need, Dr. Shaw, do you figure, for somebody with this type of redness? Um, she'll need uh, 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 anywhere from three to five treatments, and usually with a change in seasons, uh, uh, she may need a touch-up on a regular basis because you can't completely get rid of the redness and so this has to be treated uh, uh, on a yearly basis uh, as a touch-up, uh, so it, it, it will need uh, regular treatments. Okay. And so, you can see... So here we are starting. Now this device does have cooling in it, right Dr. Shaw? Yeah, so it it's has, a little more comfortable. It has lots of cooling in it and we're actually just cooling her a little bit before we fire the laser and now we're going to fire the laser and so what's the downtime for a treatment like this Dr. Cha? There is actually no downtime. Uh, she may experience a little bit of swelling for about three to four days um, and Usually it's worse, I find, on the day, of the uh, day after the treatment, and that seems to be the We're good. problem. Uh, 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 Is there anything she can take for this valley? Yes, uh, you can take uh, an antihistamine or uh, a medication, but uh, I sort of tend to assess it on a person by person um, uh, basis and I tend to make that assessment depending on the person's lifestyle. Sure. How are we doing Helena? Great. Yeah. yeah. How's the so, pain level? Um, it's not much pain at all really. I feel Good. a little bit of a, like a pinch but it's, yeah. Good. Yeah. And you can see the area that I've treated mm -hmm. uh, uh, already. And, and how often would you do these treatments Dr. Um, Shaw? For the generalized redness I tend to do them every uh, uh, four weeks, uh, but for more specific vessels, we can do them as quick as every two weeks. Depending on how aggressive, yes. right? Yeah. You, we tend to get aggressive on the first couple of treatments and then... Dr. Uh, Shaw, someone would like to know what other benefits from the machine other than redness? 
yes. Um, you can treat uh, 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 active acne. Uh, you can treat uh, 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 brown spots. Uh, you can treat some uh, birthmarks, red birthmarks, which we use this for, uh, port wine stains. Uh, we use this for quite a bit. People come in for that. Skin um, tightening too. We've skin tightening. Really good results, yes, but, yeah. uh, we do laser genesis with this for skin tightening, especially a more non-invasive way of skin tightening. Uh, the ha, e e even though this laser can do quite a few different treatments, we're lucky here in BC Laser because we have a choice of many different uh, uh, lasers that we can use. Uh, Twelve different. Uh, uh, modalities so therefore we can pick and choose and customize and tailor the treatment to the individual so uh, if somebody were to come in with a brown mark uh, I would probably uh, uh, find out exactly what the skin type is and, and uh, figure out what the mark is before I would just use any treatment some clinics are only able to use one laser so they have to try and make do with that but we are lucky in that we have quite a few choices. So, is this uh, good for all skin types? Yes, it's for all. It's for all skin types for redness, and um, uh, it's just a matter of uh, figuring out exactly the setting and uh, tailoring it to that person's skin type. Does this work for dark uh, spots on the face? Yes, it does work for dark spots on the face. Um, it really depends on the uh, person. Um, and uh, uh, as I said before, we're able to pick and choose the uh, laser that we can use. And so therefore, I may use this one or I may use uh, a couple of other different modalities. For this and why patient. would you use this versus IPL? Um, IPL is a machine which I personally don't like using. I don't uh, uh, use in this office. Um, uh, I find that some people, uh, uh, especially with slightly darker skin, uh, tend to get uh, there's a higher risk of hyperpigmentation and so therefore I uh, have chosen not to Perfect. offer it. How's it feel, Helena? We have a big thumbs up from Helena there. <laughs> Helena here uses really good home care mm -hmm. and uh, skin care so this is a would this be like a seasonal treatment for her yeah for Helena she she has got an amazing uh, home care routine so she's uh, very good um, you have to combine a treatment like this with a home care routine you can't just uh, uh, do the treatment and expect um, uh, uh, it to work uh, we combine this treatment with multiple other modalities. We use chemical peels, we use uh, 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 resurfacing lasers, uh, we use home care. Uh, so we are experts at doing combination treatments here, and so that's how we get the uh, excellent results here. Dr. Shaw, we have Yoga Girl saying that she had red veins zapped on her face with a machine called a YAG. Yes. And she wants to know if this is the same. No. Um, uh, uh, there is a YAG modality available on this machine, uh, uh, but the machine, the, the wavelength I'm using is a, called a KTP532, uh, uh, which I find is much better for redness. So how soon would the redness on uh, Helena's face disappear? Um, she'll need multiple treatments, uh, but she'll notice a result uh, even after the first treatment. Um, she'll notice a little bit of swelling for the next three, four days, and then uh, she will uh, settle down. But she'll be able to put makeup on straight after this treatment, and she'll be able to uh, uh, get back to her activities very quickly. And for those watching, we'll, we'll post uh, photos of her 
makeup right on Instagram right after so you can see what she looks like when she goes out of here and don't forget we'll be posting this uh, uh, video on YouTube and uh, uh, our Instagram stories as well yes and there's gonna be a fun video posted showing a close-up how quickly the red veins go away uh, Yoga Girl wants to know, is it capable for shrinking your pores? Yes, it is. It's capable for shrinking the pores. And um, uh, what I tend to do is I combine, if there's some redness, I combine the 532 KTP with the 1064 on this for shrinking the pores. Um, and it works quite well. But I also individualize the treatment. So I, I try and see what the underlying problem is. Uh, and so I might use different lasers as well and that's the beauty of being able to have such a large choice in this office. She says thank you. Okay. Now is this also good for rosacea? Yes, this is great for rosacea. Um, in fact, a lot of people come in for rosacea. They have also underlying uh, uh, red vessels that are uh, pretty prominent, and so this uh, takes care of it. Um, if you, I don't know if we can see, but there are a couple of red vessels here on the ala here, and I'm going to treat those if I can have some gel there. Dr. Shaw, Yoga Girl's asking what the price is for treatment, but don't we suggest coming in for a Right? Yes. Everyone's different. Yes, everyone's uh, requirements are different. And I will just read through your mouth. A little jump Perfect. there. Yes. <laughs> more well, from, uh, the, the more from the shock of actually uh, <laughs> well, doing it. The nostril sensitive. Yeah. There's the other no girl way around says, it. love the office in my Helena. <laughs> <laughs> Now, Helena had really prepped her skin with home care. How important is home care? It is very important because we want to get rid of some of that inflammation. We want to protect the skin against the sun. And we don't want any side effects of using a laser on somebody's skin. Uh, so we don't want any hyperpigmentation. And in fact, if you can see closely, she's responded so well to the red vessels on the nostril. We'll do some photos after. And you can actually see those distances. So, so she pre-prepped and post-prepped uh, with skincare. Absolutely, she she did. Um, now, what we do now is Helena's. We finished the treatment on Helena, um, but that's not the end of the story. Um, uh, after this, what we do is we have our uh, finishing touch protocol to calm the uh, skin right down, and uh, uh, Caitlin will take care of that. And after that, she can actually have uh, uh, she can go right back to work absolutely she can go right back to work uh, and uh, uh, she'll be the, the finishing touch protocol will calm the skin right down so she will not feel any uh, irritation you can see it's a little bit red at the moment uh, and uh, uh, that will calm right down in a few minutes great uh, any other questions coming up? No more questions coming up, but uh, how can they get in touch with us and if they want to? Yes, you can get in touch with us at 604-580-2464 or uh, info at bclaser.ca uh, or our website bclaser.ca uh, and our Instagram account. Uh, Send in your questions and uh, anyone that uh, has further questions and if you have uh, other topics that you'd like to see us cover let us know yes and thanks for everyone joining us today bye, bye. thank you bye.